St. Lucia's traditions, Creole language and heritage is coming into sharp focus for celebration as the month of October begins. The launch of Creole Heritage Month 2021 on Friday 1st October saw presenting agencies, events company of St. Lucia, the Monsignor Patrick Anthony Folk Research Center and the Cultural Development Foundation announcing the program for the month-long celebration for Ma Ewitage Creole. Melcher Henry is the acting executive director of the Folk Research Center. He provided insight into the calendar of activities and the theme for this year's virtual celebrations. We have quite a number of, of, of programs that I would like to go through, um, but I want to reflect a little bit on the, the, the theme, Kilte uh, say Je Wison, and also it goes on to say, Kilte sa pensé, aide pensé peinu. Um, I mean, we can look at it in a literal, literal sense in the, by, by, by examining the fact that we have these herbal remedies, and we will come to that in a while, these herbal remedies that we need to explore further, um, find out how best we can use them um, in our sustenance and so on. And at the same time, there's another, in another, in another, another inter interpretation of Kilte Sajiri Peinu is to look at it as a re-examination of ourselves, all right, to establish the values by, by, by which we should live our lives. Executive Director of the Cultural Development Foundation highlighted the entity's involvement in Moa Ewitage Creole. This year, um, for the CDF, it's no different from last year. Um, amidst all of the pandemic and everything, we are committed to bringing our culture to St. Lucians. We are once again bringing you the cultural icon series, as well as the Margaret Festival that traditionally falls in October, October 17th. Our icon series is a series, a platform that uh, celebrates the life and work of St. Lucians who have contributed at least a 25 year um, body of work, who have presented a 25 year body of work. Um, it, it's a, it's a, a platform that seeks to highlight the excellence in the art as part of our cultural and historical footprint in the arts and the contributions made by our people. The Cultural Icon Series this year will revisit and celebrate the work of past icons.